Hello my lovelies and welcome to today's video. Um, I'm very sorry that I didn't upload on Thursday. Um, I've had a really nasty cold this week which is why I didn't upload. Um, but today I will be doing my monthly thrift haul. Now I didn't really get too much this month. Um, we had a lot of family stuff going on and I didn't really get my normal chance to go out with my mum and go rooting around the charity shops. So um, I've only got a few bits, um, but the first thing I want to show you is this. Now this is my favourite thing that I got this month. This is a solid metal elephant. Um, as anybody who's watched my videos before knows, I adore elephants. They are the best thing ever. And um, my mum actually picked this up for me herself. I didn't actually get it for me. Like, I didn't get it, but my mum picked it up for me um, because she knows how much I love elephants. It sits on, um, I have a window going up my stairway and it sits in that little window um, just being a cute little elephant. Um, I'm not entirely sure what he's made of. I think he's bronze and then coated because he's very, very, very heavy. Um, but I'm not entirely sure but this is definitely my favourite thing um, and speaking of elephants I can't actually show you right now but I have an elephant duvet cover and it's a reversible one on one side it's white and it has elephants all over it and on the other side it's like a dove grey with the sort of um, mandala-y flowery sort of Indian patterns on it um, and my mum also got me that too without me being there so <clears throat> those are the two things now on to the things that I got um the first thing I bought and it's odd because it's the wrong time of year um but I bought myself some winter boots because I don't actually own any proper winter boots so I got these and these are by Vans um like they're actually they're legit proper Vans and they're quite chunky they've got a really good grip so they'll be really really good in the winter um they're sort of like bottom calf length they're an odd length um, and they have this like velcro strap here and then a zip up the front so they're nice and easy to get on um, you can slip them on but yeah they're nice and easy to get on and I paid £2.50 for these which was just brilliant an absolute amazing bargain um, so I got myself some of those um, and I actually bought two other pairs of shoes this month um, and one pair was for my cousin's funeral you may have heard I spoke about it in my last few videos um, my cousin's funeral and I had to buy a pair of black trousers they're just plain black there's not really any point in showing you and I also needed to get myself some low court high heeled shoes um, and so I picked these up I paid £1.50 for these they're by a brand called Ash um, which I've never heard of but they're just velvet suede with a little peep toe and this cross bit at the front the heel isn't majorly high um, which is what I wanted I didn't actually wear these to the funeral because the length of the trousers with these didn't work so I wore lower heels but um yeah I had to borrow those off my mum but um but yeah so I got these they're in really good nick so I really like those and on the vein of shoes I also got these now I got I got these off of eBay so I'm I don't really think they can class but these are the shoes for my wedding um, and I don't do very well in high heeled shoes and my um, my wedding dress is like a champagne colour and the other colour that's going to be involved is dark green. Now I didn't really want dark green shoes um, because I'm wearing a dark green shawl um, because my wedding will be in October, not this October, but that's when we're planning for it. So I got these, they're low silver, like some like sandals. Um, so they're absolutely perfect. The other thing is, is actually my sister-in-law is getting married in August and I'm wearing a dark green dress for their wedding and these are going to look great with that. So it's sort of like, I got those, they were on a deal. So I suppose you can say I thrifted them, but anyway, so I got those. Um, everything else is honestly from a charity shop. So the next thing I got was this. Um, this is a book by Santa Montefiore. It's the Daughters of Castle Deverell. This is actually part of a trilogy, I believe. Um, 
I have read quite a few of her other books and I really really enjoyed them so I picked this up and yeah um, I'm really looking forward to reading it. Um, the next smaller book that I got was this one and I am not expecting before anybody on here freaks out I am not having another baby I am not pregnant I just the history of names and what their names mean really fascinates me I like sort of like creating names if you like um, sort of like creating full good, good lipstick on my teeth no I haven't um, I like making like full names so like first middle sort of thing so I really enjoy doing that so I picked this up and this is the Penguin Book of Baby Names um, it's really interesting it's got some really unusual um, uncommon names in it um, from all over the world I've got a visitor from all over the world so they're re it's a really fascinating book are you gonna come say hi say hello yeah. <laughs> no squeaking say hi no <laughs> hi Okay, and now I'm on to my last three things, and the next two are within the same vein, and it is, um, I, this September hopefully, I am going to be doing a distance learning course from the University of Leicester for Forensic Science. Um, yeah, my glasses. I have to take them off because they reflect. Should I put them up here? No, there. There. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, so I picked up, um this book first of all this is the forensic science third Mama. edition this is an actual textbook Mama, this is one that is used yeah i'll put my glasses on in a minute um this one is Mama. actually a textbook it is Mama. from a course and i think i paid like two pound for this so i think it's worth the value seeing as these retail for like 30 quid um this is by dr andrew jackson and Mama. it's really interesting i've only started going through recently started going through it but so far it is very interesting Mama. and the second one i got is this and this is the forensic case book and this is more like for the layman this Mama. is yeah What's your dinosaurs? where's your dinosaurs i think they're downstairs if you die <laughs> um but yeah, so this is a, the forensic case book, and as I said, this is more for like the layman. Yeah, this is explaining yeah, the very basics. Um, follows the KISS principle, which is keep it simple, stupid. Follows that principle. Very, very easy to understand. Very, very easy to read. And oh, yeah, this was a pound, shoes. I believe. Pretty shoes. Pretty shoes, yeah. They are put on. Oh, I'm not wearing them now. Mummy's wearing them to Auntie Rachel's wedding. Um, and the last thing that I have is this, um, I just had to haul this out of the washing machine, it's still actually damp. Um, and this is just a long line um, burgundy striped white and black shirt and I absolutely adore it, it's my favourite thing to wear at the moment. I absolutely love it, it's beautiful, it's so comfortable and it's amazing. So. That is everything that I picked up in charity shops etc this month and um, yeah I will link everything down below um, for you to try it for you to have a look at if you like and I will also link down below all of my in all of my other medias my Instagram snapchat Twitter and my blog and um, yeah if you Mommy. If you liked the video, then please give it a big thumbs up and press the big red subscribe button. And I will see you guys on Tuesday. Bye-bye.